Aha. Aha, aha, aha. the hell of a party, buddy. Kid, what happened? Oh, you're gonna love this. So, I'm hanging out in the club when all of a sudden I get an urge to drain the lizard, right? I come out into the alley, and who do I see? None other than that scrawny, subpoena-answering rat, Artie McFly. And get this, the little worms whispering away I'll conquistadorial life with my Trixie! Oh, no. Naturally, I pull out Kid Junior and prepare to put a couple bullets in McFly's head which causes Artie's nose to start bleeding because he's a big wuss. And then, <laughs> and then, <laughs> what? Trixie literally gets down on the knees and begs me to let him live. <laughs> huh? Seriously, down on the knees crying and begging for McFly's life. So, uh, what did you do? What could I do? I fired two shots in the air and told Artie to take a hike. Huh, that was merciful. Hey, I got plenty of mercy. Besides, now Trixie owes me big time. And Kid Tannen always collects on his debts. Always. I guess that's Grandpa's nose blood. I guess that's Grandpa's nose blood. Welcome back, sir. Boss? Do you mind? I'm trying to have a good time here. I think you'll want to see this. Are you crazy? Bring a stick of dynamite into my club? That's just it, boss. It's all over the place. I think our speakeasy arsonist is getting ready to strike again. Chumps at the New Yorker. Man, that really looks a lot like my dad and my granddad. Sorry about this, Dad. The shrew didn't burrow deep enough. Checkerboard Charlie. Removed from the board. I guess someone jumped him. Not a pretty bunch. You in? Why not?
I'm going to play 7, 23, and 30. leads. Oh, no, no time for chit chat. I've got a rocket car to recover. Emmett, you get down from there before you hurt yourself. Hurt myself? Huh. You're far too cautious, Miss Strickland. Are you sure that's safe? Of course it's not safe. That soup kitchen he's climbing is owned by gangsters. Stop being such chickens. See? Safe as houses. Don't blame me if you end up dead. Oh, that man is so infuriating. Emmett, no, no, no time for chit-chat. I've got a rocket car to recover. Welcome back, sir. What's it going to take to get Trixie to squeal on Kid? Bartender, what'll it be? What are you drawing? Another celebrity caricature. You drew those? Prohibition ain't gonna last forever, Bob. I gotta have a skill I can fall back on when all this goes away. I'll have a drink. What's your poison? Pepsi. Uh, on second thought, forget it. Suit yourself. So is your cold all better? My cold? Yeah, when I saw you a few hours ago, you were sneezing like crazy. Mister, I ain't had a cold in over two months. Oh yeah, right. Sorry. Wrong guy. Think you could do a caricature of me? Sure. Presto! That really doesn't look like me. I didn't have much to work with. You know what happened to Trixie out there? She seems pretty freaked out. You talk weird, you know that? But no, I don't know nothing about Trixie's emotional state. Kid doesn't pay me nearly enough to pour drinks and babysit his crazy girlfriends. Thanks for the talk. Next time, order a drink. This ain't no library, you know. Trixie? Yeah? About Ernie McFly. What about him? Have you heard from him? Is he okay? Oh, yeah, he, he's okay. Are you sure? Believe me, if he wasn't okay, I'd be the first to know. About Ernie McFly. What about him? Have you heard from him? Is he okay? I think something bad might have happened to him. What? You mean Kid went back on his promise? Uh, yeah, uh, that's right. Oh, no! Oh, poor Artie! Poor sweet little Artie! I know. That rattlesnake kid! He can't get away with this! You gonna turn over the evidence you got against him? Am I ever! Just watch me! Wait a minute! What evidence do you have that Kid bumped Artie off? Um, it's just a hunch. Keep your hunches for the racetrack. It ain't nice to get a girl all worked up over unsubstantiated rumors. I talked to Kid. Oh? He told me about Artie. Oh. It was awesome of you to plead for his life. 
And it was the awesome of Kid to spare it. So you see why I gotta get rid of all the dirt I got on Kid. As long as he's loyal to me, I gotta stay loyal to him. Hey, your songs seem to have a big effect on Officer Parker over there. I am humbled and gratified that my musical gifts have fallen upon such receptive ears. Break a leg out there. Thanks. Do I really look like that? Hey! Take a hike, squirt! El Kid, I still don't get it. It's like that El Cid place down in L.A., only it's El Kid. Ah, okay, I see. Hey, right, go on, kid. I'm trying to entertain some people here. Sorry, lady. I didn't mean to get your boyfriend kicked out of the club. Oh, water under the bridge. You want to keep the seat warm? Uh, thanks anyway. Uh, Trixie? Yeah? Break a leg out there. Thanks. You in? Hey, Doc, I can use a little help. What's the problem? Good news, Doc. Parker's ready to arrest Tannen, and it looks like I didn't go stag to the prom. Wonderful. What about Miss Trotter? I'm still working on her. Things are getting worse, Doc. In order to keep Artie safe, Trixie's going to destroy her evidence against Tannen. You have to stop her. How? The only thing that would make her turn on Kid now is if she welched on the deal and killed my grandfather. Well, you can't let that happen. Okay, I better get back to fixing history. Be careful, Marty. <laughs> 